you guessed it, arrested. Lil Mosey gets glass thrown at him on stage, plus Ebro reacts to the backlash following his Kodak Black interview. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life, and shout out to Coyle Ray. Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse just came out, and Jersey's own is in the film soundtrack with Luga Cash, Ski Mask, and Jacquees. Also, random shout out to the visual mastermind Shaniqua. You get a shout out. You get a shout out. But all right, DJ Academics posted a video to Instagram of Lil Mosey getting a glass cup thrown at him on stage. Ouch, right in the head. But unlike NBA Youngboy, Mosey doesn't resort to fighting anyone. The rapper even stops his entourage and members of the audience from getting violent and simply requests that the culprit leave the venue. No, no, we're not fighting the Who That was a lie. What the f? Who's who did I say? Whoever do it, get him out of here. No, wait, that's not right here. Get him out. Hey, hey, stop fighting. Hey, chill out. Y'all chill out. I really respect the way he handled this. Shout out to Lil Mosey. Shout out to academics. Shout out, shout out. Moving on to Ebro, the radio host has been receiving major backlash from every direction after a video went up of Kodak Black walking out of an interview on Ebro in the morning. Well, so they the tried to change the subject. They was talking about the moon landing. That's bullshit too. Uh -huh. Talk about something else. Well, I was saying, I, I think- We I don't th have to talk about nothing else. We could be done right here. All right, I'm gone. Say less. That's a bummer. Uh. Ebro has been voicing his opinion about all the people slamming him via his Twitter account, but he also spoke his mind about the moment back in the studio with Rosenberg. I'm not happy it went that no, you way. Felt bad about I it feel bad that it went that way because I felt like I was honestly trying to have a balanced conversation with an individual who has a crazy past, dealing with some very real things that is very... It's very right now. Yeah, it's murky. And it's ugly and nasty, and it makes nobody happy. But okay, on to Lil Pump. TMZ reports the rapper was kicked off a flight because TSA allegedly found drugs in his bag. Well, it turns out TSA made a mistake. A source told the site that no drugs were actually found in the bag, but instead the bag was flagged by TSA for smelling like weed. So why was Pump arrested? Reportedly, the rapper became disorderly during an argument with TSA. Before we end this video, quick shout out to the couple that got engaged at Bad Babies concert the other day in Australia. They reached out to me on Instagram and thanked us for including them in yesterday's video. So we love you and you can follow me at Alex Stagnita too. So you can reach out to me and I can chat you out on our video. But all right guys, hit the sub like and bell button and the word of the day is wombo. So leave a comment using that word in a sentence. I wombo, you wombo, he, she, we wombo. Bye.